breaking news this afternoon. The University of Arkansas has announced they will play the Arkansas State Red Wolves in football in 2025. This will be the first time in history of the state that the two teams have faced off on the gridiron. Huge news this afternoon. DJ Williams joins us now live to discuss more about this historic announcement. And DJ, this has been something Arkansans have been wanting for a long time. Were you surprised when you heard the news today? I was shocked. You know, they told me to come back in studio. We got news. I said, stop playing with me. That did not happen, you know? And then uh, it's funny you say uh, a lot of people from Arkansas, um, Mallory, have been waiting for this. I'm going to correct your statement just a little bit. A lot of Arkansas State fans have wanted this to happen for some time now. Uh, it's just uh, when you look at this game, Mallory, you just kind of look at, you know, program versus program. I know a lot of the time Arkansas plays out of conference um, programs all the time and uh, not power five teams and they lose to them, you know, quite often, you know, but to do it in your home state, you know, where the Arkansas Razorbacks, when it comes to being pretty much the alpha team in every other college program here, all the support goes to the Razorbacks. You know, when you think of Arkansas sports, you know, we don't have the Dallas Cowboys. Like the Razorbacks are the professional team. It's always been that way. And uh, I think it's a pretty bold move um, that we're going down this route because you have to look at it as an aspect of a business plan, uh, Mallory. Now, competitive-wise, as an athlete, I would very much like to play this game. But business side... Arkansas State has absolutely nothing to lose. Arkansas has everything to lose. And as far as gain, a state has everything to gain. And if Arkansas wins this game, the Razorbacks, that is, it, they're supposed to. And I, I, Alyssa was kind of touching on the program stance um, about how this may not be the best decision for a program to play a team in your own state like Arkansas State, as far as Razorbacks are concerned, Alyssa. Yeah, absolutely, DJ. And I think you make a really good point. When we, you and I, cover this football team, we've seen how upset fans get when they lose to non-conference teams like a Portland State, Toledo, uh, ULL, uh, ULM, uh, Colorado State, right? We'll just add Arkansas's name to that team, and it's going to cause some friction. Uh, so from a standpoint, from a program specifically, and people need to understand that's where we're looking at right now, uh, Arkansas is is putting a lot to gamble on playing these games. Now, from a fan standpoint, from a war memorial standpoint, you look at that stadium and wonder what the future looks like. Well, the future looks like Arkansas plays in-state opponents like UAPB, Arkansas State. You could easily see if UCA down the road would maybe want to join in as well. Um, and that's how you continue to build revenue, get more people in the stands. When you're playing teams with fan bases from from around your area, you're going to definitely get more excitement. That excitement is coming from every other school right now, DJ, uh, except Arkansas. Yeah, and uh, just uh, toss about that. I will say the one thing as an Arkansas fan and alum that I wish we had is a true rival. I know we don't like LSU. I know we don't like Texas. We don't like mm -hmm. Texas A&M. Um, they don't care anything about us. It would be really cool to have a one rivalry game every year that means something this would be the team to play. Yeah, I think so. And, and we said this on the LBS that you and I did with Tara Talmadge just a little bit ago. But uh, I know we all know Arkansas State fans who have been waiting for this to happen, who are ready to talk some trash. Look, I married an Arkansas State alum, so I understand how excited people are for this game. So we'll see what 2025 looks like and uh, what this Arkansas team under Sam Pittman and possibly this Arkansas State team under Butch Jones, if those two coaches are still there in 2025, what it looks like. Yeah, you better believe they scheduled it 2025 on purpose. Give Arkansas some time to get their stuff in, for sure. Mallory? <laughs> DJ and Alyssa both live. Thank you so much for your insight. Again, that game happening in 2025. To recap now, the University of Arkansas signed an amendment to an existing agreement with the Arkansas Department of Parks, Heritage, and Tourism to bring those two additional Razorback football games to Central Arkansas in future seasons, extending the overall agreement through the 20. 25 season. It will be held at War Memorial. We are talking 2025 at this point, but all, already so much talk about this game just in the past hour since it's been announced. We want to bring in a former ASU quarterback. Philip Butterfield joins us now live with his reaction, hearing how ASU is reacting to the news. Philip, thank you so much for joining us. 
What would this mean when you were a quarterback at ASU and you heard the news you were about to play the Razorbacks? Well, I appreciate you having me. Um, definitely an exciting time for the program. Uh, looking back over the past 10, 15 years and how the ASU program has continued to grow and, and obviously gotten on the national stage quite a bit now. Um, I think for, uh, for us to play Arkansas, I think it's a great opportunity. Absolutely. We were just hearing from our Pig Trail Nation team and former tight end DJ Williams. He was saying Arkansas State has nothing to lose. Arkansas has everything to lose. What would this mean for Arkansas State if, if Arkansas State won this game? Uh, I think for the program, uh, we kind of look at it as, a, as a, a really good opportunity to not only play an SEC team, but to play an in-state team. Um, and to look at that from a, a, a long-term perspective, we want to continue to grow. And, and, and I, I don't think Terry Mahajer and, and Coach Jones, I don't think anybody's, to, I think everybody's ready to, to kind of take the next step and play whoever's going to be on the schedule. But for this, it's obviously a special game uh, going forward. Absolutely. Arkansas State, very love. You have represented Arkansas amazing on the national stage. Many big games you've won the past few years have been big. This will be a big matchup. I know you will probably be there. Thank you so much for joining us today. Philip Butterfield with the latest on that announcement. You can read the latest on our website and more. We have learned about several other games, including a matchup against UAPB. That is all on our website.